All right, final email today comes to us from Daim Chowdhury, who writes, Recently, Stephen Amell said that if Green Arrow were to be on the big screen, they would have to include characters like Diggle and Felicity because those characters are the most impactful thing Arrow has done to Green Arrow lore, and this was met with mixed responses, to put it lightly. I understand he's proud of his show, but do you think he's overestimating Arrow's legacy to the point where it could affect a potential big screen appearance? Okay, so for those of you who don't know what Daim's talking about, Stephen Amell was being talked about, uh, he was being asked a question, and he said, you know, Diggle and Felicity, I, like, they were created on the show. I do not believe they were existing characters in the DC Green Arrow universe prior to the show. And he's basically asked, he's like, hey, if, you, if a Green Arrow movie was ever done, he said, you have to have Diggle now, and you have to have Felicity because they are so a part of Green Arrow lore now, you'd have to put them in a movie. Now, as Dean points out, the fan response to that quote was mixed at best. There was some, and I got to tell you this. I think Stephen Amell is completely wrong. He's completely wrong. And I, I love Stephen Amell and he's great as Green Arrow, but he's wrong about this. If you do a movie now, one of the actual, the things that you need to do is to differentiate your movie version from the television version. I think that's one of the things you need to do in keeping the movie and the TV universes separate. One of the things you need to do is that if you do have characters that appear on both mediums, you've got to take some steps to differentiate the movie version from the TV version. Diggle and Felicity have never been things in the Green Arrow lore until the TV show came along. But let's not pretend like Green Arrow is one of the highest rated shows on television. Let's not pretend like everybody on the United States watches Green Arrow. They don't. It, it gets pretty decent ratos, ratings for a CW show, yes. But let's not overestimate the value of that. So I, I think if anything, it just increases the importance to leave out a Diggle and to leave out a Felicity just to make sure you differentiate the movie version from the television version. So on a lot of different levels, I think Stephen Amell is wrong. But again, I totally respect that he's sticking up for his show. He's sticking up for his fellow castmates. He's sticking up for the characters that they created. And I respect that. I think that's great. He's saying what he should say. I just think what he's saying is incorrect. That's all. So anyway, that's just kind of my thoughts on it. What do you guys think? Do you think that if they did a Green Arrow movie that they should include a Diggle character and a Felicity character? Or do you think, like I do, that they should leave them out? Jump down in the comments section. Let me know what you think and let me know why you think it. All right, guys. With that out of the way, we got about 10 minutes left here. So let's get over and take some of your guys' live questions.